Today we're going to show you how to download this fabulous program called GeoGebra. And if you're on your web browser, go to your home page and just go ahead and type in GeoGebra, G-E-O-G-E-B-R-A. And you may notice that some other things pop up down here, and that's fine. But let's just go ahead and uh, see what happens here. And here is GeoGebra. And you've got a number of links on here. The first one is the main international site. You've got a download and a forum and all kinds of other things. Then there's a GeoGebra Institute of Ohio. There's also uh, Math 247, which is a lot of tutorials. Uh, you have something of mine on here, Mr. L's Math. You have the Wikipedia version here for GeoGebra, which is very cool. But let's go ahead and select the very first one up here, which is the main GeoGebra site. And if you click on that, and I'll save us some time here, we'll go right to the next window. This is the main site here called GeoGebra. And if you look up at the top here, you'll see that it's actually geogebra.org slash CMS. And that's where you end up. So if you want to bookmark that, that'll save you some time in the future. And uh, if you're interested in downloading this software, you just go right here and press your download button. And that takes you to this window where you have a couple of options. First one here is called Web Start. And if you want the complete program, you click this one. If you want a slightly modified program for younger students or just a simpler program with not as many options, you would go here. Uh, if you don't want to install anything on your computer yet, just playing around and see if this is what you want, then go ahead and do this applet start. And just a, a note here, this program is free, it's open source, it runs on the Java programming language, so it doesn't matter whether you have a PC or a Mac or even whether you're running Linux, it'll all run the same, totally free. A few other options here on, on this page, you have the email list, uh, which you can stay informed about GeoGebra. They have a newsletter that comes out once a month. An offline installer for those teachers or other people that have students or friends that don't have an internet connection. You can download the package and run it right off a flash drive or a CD. And just a reminder that you've got the GeoGebra license here. You're free to copy, distribute, and transmit for non-commercial purposes. So uh, pick an option there and uh, we'll download it and the next screen you see will be the actual GeoGebra program on my computer. So here is the GeoGebra program and uh, I'm not going to go too far, too much further with it because the main point here is just to show you how to download the program. But you've got a couple of options here. This is the main graphing window over here. You've got the familiar X and Y axis. This area here is called the algebra window where uh, things will show up, uh, your ordered pairs, if you happen to type things in and you want uh, circles or lines or triangles, whatever you want. This keeps track of it in algebra format. On the top here you have the standard file menu, new, open, save, and so forth, and you have edit and view and so forth. And uh, that's uh, all good. But the main power of GeoGebra lies right in this row here, which is your icon row. And in each one of these boxes here, just very quickly, you have a, a little triangle in the lower right, and that reveals other options. So I'll just very quickly show you a couple of them, and then we'll call this a day. Uh, once you have GeoGebra program downloaded, then you can go ahead and play with it. And I remember distinctly when I uh, downloaded this program, I was in my uh, recliner, and I don't think I got up for about three hours. I kept playing with it, trying to find things that it would do, things that it wouldn't do, and I was just a real happy camper. So I wish you the very best with GeoGebra, and I hope you have as much fun with it as I have.